Hey, what's up, guys? What's happening? Snowball here, and in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to make this scattered brush, and it's customizable. So yeah, enjoy. First off, click File, New, and make the size and stuff whatever you want. Click OK. I'm just going to be adding a gradient straight off, just so it's easier for the end final piece. Yeah. Okay, so the way you want to make this brush is by going to the brush tool on the side here and selecting the first solid round brush, this one. The size and size doesn't really matter. You can edit that whenever you want. Okay, now what you want to do is click this button right next to it. If you do not see this button, it will be over here. Over here, right here. So for now what you want to do is click Shape Dynamics, Scattering, and Transfer. For shape dynamics, you want to put the size jitter at 100% and everything else at zero. For scattering, um, put this at one. I put it normally between 1,000 and 900%, but this is your own choice and stuff. And mess around with these controls for other options and how it looks. So yeah, for count, put it at one because that just looks retarded. So yeah, one. And count jitter, I normally use between 90 and 83. So anywhere between that doesn't really make a difference. Now for transfer, put the opacity jitter to 100% and flow jitter to zero. This one just makes the whole thing transparent. And yeah, you can, after you are happy with what you got and mess around, be creative, guys. And you want to make this into a brush. Go down here, this corner, and click create brush. Now name it whatever you want. So scatter, click OK, close this up, uh, now make a new layer over this and go back to your brush tool and it should appear at the bottom here look. So yeah, edit, you can edit the size and you can mess around with the hardness for different effects and yeah this is what you get in the end. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, hope it taught you how to make a new brush, and yeah, comment, rate, and subscribe, give me comments on new, on tutorials that you guys want, so it gives me ideas, because I'm totally out of ideas right now, so yeah, much appreciated, peace.